Virgil Sr. here, Virgil. Hey, hey, uh, your son with a, a sensational first round knockout. How would you assess his performance? Oh, he did pretty good. I'm oh, sorry, Rick. He did, he, morning, all right. Yes, sir. He did pretty good. He, uh, you know, he went in there and, and uh, did, did what he's supposed to do, as in, like, when something's open to hit it. Uh, you know, I'm sure he wanted a lot more rounds than that. We spoke about that. I told him, look, if it starts going a bunch of rounds, don't get, don't make a, too much of an effort to, to take him out. Take your time and uh, get some rounds in. And uh, but if it's whatever is open, and if you, if you uh, hurt him, take him out. Go ahead and take him out. You don't get paid overtime. There's a lot of people on Twitter that were saying that were saying uh, Virgil's back. You know, the Virgil Bold is back. Um, I know you might say he never went away anywhere. What message do you have to those folks, you know, that got rejuvenated faith in, in Virgil in this fight? Well, well you know, it's funny. Uh, um, I think a lot of people were, were sad that what was happening to my son. Of course, you have the, your typical haters and stuff like that, right? But in overall, uh, you know, Virgil, when he fights, when he comes out, there's something about him that I guess I don't know if people relate to him or that Fernando Vargas feeling. You know, when they played his music, he came out. The energy of the crowd, you can feel the goosebumps on, on your arms, and, and uh, he, he's just one of those kids that you know he's gonna give you a fight. It, it's, he keeps you on the on, on the edge of your chair at all times, and it's uh, it's just uh, that's part why everybody's so happy and excited. Him. But he's a good kid. He deserves to, everything that, that he gets and receives. You know what I mean? So uh, that, that's that's more like what. How does it feel as a dad? You know, everywhere we go, whether it's you know, in your home state of Texas, whether it's in LA, whether it's here in Fresno, just to, to feel that love from the from the crowd, from the Mexican hopefuls. Yeah, it's it's always great. Look, everywhere we go, the pe people are real good with my son. They love him. Uh, you know, obviously because my son, the way he acts, he, 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 there really shouldn't be nobody that dislikes him because he's such a good kid. I mean, he really is. So, uh, I mean, we're happy. Uh, I feel like we also give hope to the people that, that are struggling and that are, because we've come from there. You know, we give them hope that it's possible, but at the same time, you know, you got to work for it. You don't think it's just going to happen to happen. So, like I said uh, earlier, I think a lot of people relate to him, uh, uh, to me, my son, you know, the, the stuff that we've gone through, uh, the, the financial issues since we were a kid and have nothing, you know. Uh, but, uh, you know, and then we, my son's humble. You know, he doesn't act like he's a superstar. He don't need security around him. He don't care for all that, you know. He, he literally will go to a... a to, I don't know, like like some kind of show where, where people are, are meeting up with their Lambos and all that, and he'll pull up in his little Honda Civic, <laughs> uh, or, or, you know, his uh, his Ford, his Mustang, his little Mustang that he likes, that he's that I bought him, an 05 Mustang, so uh, he's just a normal kid that, that when you see him, you would never expect for him to be who he is, because he just acts like a, like a normal kid. Yeah, he's like the kid next door, but he's also a beast. He, uh, yeah. A lot, a lot of fans were, were a little shocked, both from your son and from Tinzu that this is the fight that's next. Um, they're saying that the respect levels is, is up for these two, and they're saying that they expect this to be a throwback 80s kind of fight. Is that what you also envision? Well, I, I've, I've known this since a long time ago when I've seen Tinzu. I've actually liked watching Tinzu. Uh, he's exciting. Uh, he'll fight you. He's there to fight. Uh, he's there to please the fans, but he's also there to, to fight. It, it, it's just different. Um, I've always known that uh, this is a, like I've told uh, people before this is a man's fight there's a difference from a fight a boxing match where you move around some guys inside can throw but when you're in a man fight a violent fight that's different That that's, that's you know whenever you fight guys like that those guys don't want to be in the pocket with those kind of guys even in the amateurs when someone fight those guys you know you can look it up the guys just ran, 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 and you can call it boxing. But when they were in the pocket, they, they were there was nothing they can do. They were just holding on for dear life and wait for those those, those two minutes or three minutes of those three minute rounds to, to go off. And, and uh, that's it. it. It's just different. This is this is a this is a good fight. This is definitely this is one you don't have to sell acting like a fool or, or saying this or doing it. This, this alone sells it. Just just look at the two guys. I mean, look at look at the performances how they fight. It, it's it's a it's a dream for a lot of people to, to see something like this. There's no title on the line, but it almost feels like it's a championship caliber there fight. There is a title on the line. There's a WBA intern title on the line, I believe. Does uh, the winner of this match get... get that? Get Well, the winner of this match gets the winner of, uh, I believe, uh, of uh, Crawford and uh, the guy that he's fighting. So yeah. there, there is a title on there. And there's a lot of respect, a lot of similarities between Tenzu and your son. Oh, yeah, there definitely is. Uh, you know, you can see, you know, when two guys at a high level, they're fight that way see each other and they they respect so now i'm saying they're gonna be buddy buddies and and, and and you know be friends and hang out 
but they definitely recognize each other and they definitely know that one has the other one has the same kind of part it's just going to be more about who uh the chess is this going to be now like a chess match i, I believe it's going to be like a calculated chess match